Okay, you ready? So do, so do, so do, bomb! You've got the glow of love. I understand that you're in love with him. I'm not in love with him. This video is the Korean and American American Judy Ju who is in the Wendy Williams show. Judy Ju is a Korean recipe for Korean food. She is a Korean recipe for Korean food. And she is a Korean recipe for Korean food. Let's see if we can confirm it. We're going to make some kimchi arancini. Off of the Italian arancini and also some royal duck bokki. Good. It's really good. So this this is the rice. We're gonna mix it all together, but you gotta make this rice taste really good. And so that's also part of the sweet soy sauce that I've made. That's made from soy sauce, vinegar, mirin, some garlic, sugar, gochugara, which is Korean chili flakes and sesame oil and ginger. This is royal duck bokki. So since you're the duck, no duck bokki. Duck is this. Duck. Okay, it's rice cakes, right? How do you say it? Duck. How do you spell it? T T E O K. Oh, talk. Talk. Okay. Yeah, talk. How so, you do? <laughs> how you do? Okay. okay. Exactly. Okay. Very, now, what very is hot. this? This is the duck. This is a rice cake. It's kind of like a, a chewy gnocchi. It really is. It's like chewing gum. It's like bubble gum. It's good though, right? It's like it's like very sticky flavorful. rice. It's sticky rice. Mm -hmm. This is just full of all the great Korean ingredients. So soy sauce, some rice vinegar, some gochujang. Some What's uh, that? Gochujang. You wanna try some? You wanna try some? Try some hot sauce. This is fermented Korean chili paste. It's great. Mm, that's really good. Isn't that great? It's full of flavor, full of... Action. Oh my God. Yes. It's good. Oh, it's got kick. It's got kick. It's got kick. It sneaks up on you. It's very good, Judy. Have you ever had soju? No, Judy. You're a soju virgin. Soju, sir, soju is Korea's fire water. It is our version of vodka. I like fire water. Fire water, yeah, there you go. And it is made from rice and water. And it's kind of like a Jaeger bomb or a sake bomb. Okay. So when you drink it, I haven't done this since I was like in college. college. I know. College, okay, so we have a little bit of fun here. And I'm glad your first time's with me. So we're gonna do this in the ritual chant, okay? Drink, so drink, drink, drink. We're gonna do soju, soju, oh, okay. soju, and then slam our fists down okay. in women power. Okay. And then we're gonna chug it. Chug what, Judy? <laughs> this is a soju shot. It's gonna fall into the beer. It's gonna, you know, bubble up. What are we doing up. with the sticks? No, no, no. Soju, 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 bomb! And then the vibrations make the. Uh, oh, I, okay, I got it. Go. Okay, oh. you ready? Uh huh. Soju, 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 soju bomb! bomb. Oh. Oh. Now let's try learning some expressions. You've got the glow of love. I understand oh. that you're in love with them. Um, Glow는 긍정적인 의미를 내포하고 있는 참 이쁜 단어입니다. 동사로 쓰일 때 빛나다의 뜻입니다. 명사로 쓰이는 경우 자세히 알아볼게요. 첫 번째, 불빛. The city was just a red glow on the horizon. 두 번째, 홍조. The fresh air had brought a healthy glow to her cheeks. 세 번째, 단풍. The glow of autumn leaves. 네 번째, 기쁨. 만족감을 동반한 은근한 감정. When she looked at her children, she felt a glow of pride. You've got the glow of love. 영상에서 쓰임이 네 번째 쓰임으로 사랑의 감정에 빠져 있다. 또 해석됩니다. That I've made that's made from soy sauce, vinegar, mirin, some garlic, sugar, gochugara, which is Korean chili flakes and sesame oil and ginger. 영어를 공부하지만 의외로 양념과 소스는 모르는 경우가 많아 같이 공부해봐요. Soy sauce, soy sauce, 간장, vinegar, vinegar, 식초, garlic, garlic, 마늘, sugar, sugar, 설탕, sesame oil. Sesame oil, 참기름, ginger, ginger, 생강. Oh, it's got kick! It's got kick! It's got kick! It's got a kick. 맵다는 표현을 주로 hot, spicy, chili를 쓰지만, it has a kick. It's got a kick. 또 실제로 자주 쓰입니다. 입 안에서 뭔가 차는 듯한 느낌? 우리 말로는 쏘는 듯한 느낌. 으로 이해하면 잘 외워질 거예요. 맵다. It's got kick. 조금 맵다. It's got a bit of a kick. 조금 더 맵다. It's got a bit more of a kick. 
It sneaks up on you. Sneaks up on은 뒤에서 몰래 다가가는 걸 말합니다. 그래서 그녀가 그위 뒤로 몰래 다가갔다. 는 다음과 같이 쓸수 있어요. She snuck up on him. 영상에서는 It sneaks up on you 라고 함은 매운맛이 바로 느껴지지 않고 뒤에서 몰래 오는 것처럼 나중에 올라온다는 의미로 쓰였습니다. Did you enjoy the talk show? 구독과 좋아요 꾹꾹 눌러주세요. See you next time. 제발.